won't compromise security, UK, nationality borders bill to criminalize illegal entry of refugees amid Taliban siege. Criminalizing entry into Kabul was one of the options, if anyone was proven to have visited outlawed territory, a source said adding proposals were underway. The UK on Monday declared that it was in a discussion about national security aspects and there were proposals to blacklist Afghanistan and imprison those that enter the Taliban-dominated territory for at least 10 years. Criminalizing entry into Afghanistan was one of the options, if anyone was proven to have visited the outlawed territory, a source told UK newspaper The Telegraph. Likewise, while the UK government was committed to admitting thousands of citizens fleeing the Taliban under the Afghanistan Citizens Resettlement Scheme, it stated on Monday that it will not compromise the vital security of British citizens as it criminalised for Afghans to knowingly arrive illegally in the UK without permission to be here. Under its Nationality and Borders Bill, the Boris Johnson administration stated that it will criminalise those who knowingly enter the UK without permission to seek asylum as the migration routes would be kept under constant review. Similarly, discussions are ongoing to criminalise those that enter the war-ravaged country now in control of the Taliban. Under the Afghan Citizens Resettlement Scheme, not yet launched, UK plans to allow just 5,000 vulnerable Afghans into the country. The scheme will be offered only to those who have been forced to flee Kabul, with up to a total of 20,000 over a five-year period, according to UK's Home Office fact sheet on resettlement routes for Afghan nationals. The British government plans to release further details in due course on both of these proposals soon. Read Afghanistan, Taliban urges religious leaders to assure citizens of their safety security. The UK also plans to admit an additional 5,000 Afghans under the Afghan Relocations and Assistance Policy ARAP, although it warned that those resorting to illegal routes to enter the UK will face consequences as the government has a duty to protect the security of the UK and the safety of its citizens.